Hi, I'm Richard Byrne. In this video, I'm going to show you how to measure perimeter and area in the web version of Google Earth. Let's go ahead and take a look at how to do it. So you can see I have Google Earth pulled up here in my web browser. I'm in Boston. I'm right near Fenway Park. And let's use the measuring tool over here on the left hand side to measure the perimeter and the area of let's say this building right here and I want to zoom in so that I have a more accurate starting place and I'm going to just simply click there on the corner and click down here click around and you'll see it's measuring as I go and back to the starting place to close the shape and you can see we have the perimeter and you can see that in feet but you could also switch it out and look at it in yards, miles, smoots, kilometers, meters, nautical miles, or centimeters. And the same thing with area. It automatically calculated it in acres, but you can change it out to square feet, square yards, square nautical miles if you wanted to, square kilometers, or square meters. Now I'm going to close that out. And that was a very simple way to measure just going around in that nice rectangle, very easy to do. But let's say you have an object or something that's a little more complicated, like Fenway Park itself. And we can still do the same type of measuring and Google Earth will still calculate it for us. I'm going to start here at the corner and I'm gonna go right around the perimeter. Now again, you may want to zoom in so that you have a more accurate line that you draw as you go around, or you can zoom out if you just want to get more of a ballpark estimate of the perimeter and area of the space that you're measuring. And you can see here, I'm just going to ballpark it as I go, and I can click and zoom as I need to. I'm going to go right around the corner here and we'll come all the way down here, go across and I'm going to continue to measure. I'm going to pop out right there for a second then pop back in and keep going along the wall here. Go back out and now there we are back at the beginning and we can see it's about 8.6 acres that the whole ballpark and complex occupies but we can switch that out to any of those other units of measurement likewise we can swap out the feet for meters or yards or miles and inches if we wanted to so that's how you can measure perimeter and area in the web version of google earth as always for more things like this please visit practicaledtech.com, freetechforteachers.com, or subscribe to my YouTube channel.